Afghans coming to Europe are very much in focus right now, and this is particularly being highlighted here in Germany following terrible events that took place on Saturday in a district of Berlin, which a 29-year-old man from Afghanistan has been arrested following the stabbing to death of a 58-year-old woman. A 66-year-old man was also seriously wounded in that attack. What we know so far about the 29-year-old is that when it's been reported in local media that the attack was prompted following him being upset that this woman had been working as a gardener. What we know from the police is that they had no information on him as a potential link to extremism before this had happened. However, we do understand that he was receiving psychiatric treatment. He arrived here in Germany in 2016 and has been arrested on suspicion suspicion of murder, aggravated assault and dangerous assault. This case involving a man from Afghanistan has more focus when we look at the potential for increasing numbers of people from Afghanistan looking to seek refuge here in Europe. Sebastian Kurz, the Austrian chancellor, has said Europe may not be that welcoming towards people coming from Afghanistan. In fact, previously, he said that his country would take no more refugees on his watch. Now he's saying that it's nearby countries to Afghanistan that should be looking to take in refugees. We're absolutely convinced that the people leaving Afghanistan should be cared for in neighboring countries, and it shouldn't reach a point where these people set out for Europe. Sebastian Kurz was speaking alongside the Serbian Prime Minister, Alexander Vucic. Kurz said that European leaders would not be as welcoming as they had been six years ago. There's been a rethink among a lot of European officials and heads of state, and, thankfully, Germany's position today is different to the one they held back in 2015. Well, back in 2015, it was German Chancellor Angela Merkel who led the call saying that Germany could and Europe could accept refugees from the Syrian crisis. Six years on, the message has changed somewhat. And what we're seeing is particularly strong pushback from countries like Greece and Italy, as well as countries like Serbia and Austria, saying that Europe cannot take any more refugees and that they aren't prepared to step up when it comes to accepting people from Afghanistan. What we have seen in the six years following the message from Angela Merkel that Germany could help and Germany could take people in was that Europe's migration and refugee and asylum policies, well, they haven't been unified in the slightest. And they're policies that look like they're going to be put to the test in coming months.